The Ghost of the Night Barn owls are often viewed as mysterious and haunting creatures that hunt by night and roost during the day. Hi, I'm Amy of Fox Run and welcome to my channel. Barn owls are easy to distinguish with their wide dished face and creamy colored chest and underwings. They have adapted to using man-made structures, thus the name barn owl. Tito alba is the species you are most likely to see in the U.S. They nest in trees and rock cavities and, of course, barns. Barn owls are the most widely distributed owl and are found throughout the United States, down into Central America, as well as parts of Europe, Africa, and Asia. They live in open habitats across the United States, including farmland, grassland, deserts, marshes, suburban parks, and cities. Barn owls must like baseball because they nest in Yankee Stadium, as well as other ballparks. They are welcome in urban areas because they hunt rats. Barn owls are a smaller owl species and weigh an average of one and a half pounds. They are about a foot tall and have a wingspan of around three feet. The barn owl has an extremely good sense of hearing. It can catch mice in complete darkness in the lab. Their dished face allows the sound waves to concentrate and enter the ears, which are directly behind the eyes. Barn owls eat a variety of rodents and swallow their prey whole. Rats, mice, voles, lemmings, and shrews, as well as bats and rabbits. They occasionally eat other birds, such as starlings or blackbirds. About twice a day, they cough up pellets of things they can't digest, such as bones and fur. The pellets make a great record of what the owls have eaten, and scientists study them to learn what these birds prey on. Taking apart these pellets is a great science activity. Watch for a future video on this. Ah, barn owls are usually monogamous sticking with one partner for a lifetime. If one of the pair dies, they will seek another widow or widower to pair bond with. Please give this video a like as you are watching. The male will start feeding the female even before she lays eggs. This helps improve her stamina and health. In the U.S., nesting takes place in early spring between March and June. Depending on the availability of prey, barn owls will often have two broods a year. The female lays an average of five eggs and sets on them for a month. Barn owls are cavity nesters, and the female is a great mother. Fun fact, she uses her regurgitated pellets to line the nest. The female stays at the nest for the first month while the male brings food. Chicks are born with a fluffy white down. They grow very quickly. By two weeks, they are half their adult weight. One study showed that owl chicks will often negotiate for food. In some bird species, the larger chick gets the most food, but for barn owls, it's a little more democratic. By nine weeks, they are fully fledged and leaving the nest for short flights. Sadly, barn owls are susceptible to being hit by cars. Like most owls, their eyes only look straight ahead. They fly low when hunting and are focused on finding their prey. The great horned owl is a natural predator of adult barn owls. I will put a link to my great horned owl video in the description box. The biggest prey to young barn owls is the Virginia opossum. Consider putting up a barn owl nesting box. This is an easy DIY project for you, or you can purchase one. I'll put a link for both in the description. 
Barn owls are a species of least concern, and we want to help them stay that way. Drive slowly at night and put up a nest box if you are able. Check out my video on the great horned owl next. Thanks for watching and have a fabulous day.